Everybody talks about what one should do to get the OSCP, but no one talks about what to do after that. So I think that they're talking about what would be your first step towards getting a job after you got the OSCP. Yep. So uh, OSCP prepares you for what I call like that external methodology. It gives you the how to scan, how to enumerate, how to look for things, you know, how to try harder and work your way through that sort of mindset. Uh, what it fails to do is really teach you a lot of what a pen tester does on a day-to-day -day basis, which can be a lot of things. Uh, so on the external side, I think it's great. It does it does a good good job there. Uh, within adding in some concepts like uh, adding in credential stuffing or password spraying attacks against login forms are probably the biggest way that we get in right now. And then you take the that methodology and you add in internal methodology, which isn't taught in the OSCP. And you're talking Active Directory pen testing. Uh, so you have to learn Active Directory pen testing. There are there are blogs out there, there's courses out there varying from you know um, free, cheap, or upwards of thousands of dollars if you wanna learn it, but uh, there's resources out there to do so. Web application penetration testing as well, so learning that really makes you a more qualified candidate. And I'd like to add in probably wireless, uh, which is pretty straightforward to learn, and uh, social engineering helps as well just to have the understanding of what it is and that, that mindset. So really the big four, external, internal, uh, so, uh, wireless and web app would be the, the big four there. So you have to well round yourself out there. On top of that, you should be good with report writing. So you should be well written and you should be good with like debriefing skills, being able to talk to somebody. Again, you don't have to be an extrovert. You just have to be able to put on a fake face in front of a client and say like, here's your findings and be able to kind of ex explain technical things to maybe somebody who's not technical. Uh, so that explain like I'm five mindset and being able to do that really helps uh, be successful in this field as well. So there's a lot that a, a certification will get you in the door. So that certification will get you an interview, but there's a lot to learn after that. Uh, so the, the better prepared you are, the more of these uh, traits that you have when you go into an interview, the better off you're going to be. Fellas, check out my Python basics course to learn the fundamentals of Python you need in cybersecurity. There's a discount link in the description.